What's up you guys, it's Matt here. So I wanted to talk about something interesting that came across my desk. Now it's not 100% confirmed to say that this is exactly where it's going. So I want you to know that this is sort of speculation where it's at and um, don't take it as exactly the truth, but understand that we need to question it because questions get the real answers, right? Obviously. So I wanted to focus on the she token and Shiba Inu token, right? She is supposed to be the stable coin that's created by the ecosystem. Now, from what I'm hearing, there's something very interesting that's going to be happening, uh, apparently, um, and this is uh, allegedly, right? Um, that she will be connected to Shiba Inu. Now, we need to talk about this and see how that will be a, a good thing or a bad thing within the ecosystem. And if we're looking at that to improve our Shiba Inu position or to completely um, you know, collapse our Shiba Inu position. So before we get started, guys, make sure you hit the like button. Also hit the subscribe button for more videos like this one. And make sure you check out some of those links down below because it does help out the channel quite a bit. I think this is very, very important uh, that we need to you know, figure out what is the real idea behind this and what will back um, this stable coin. <clears throat> um, so, before we actually dive into that, if you could follow the Discord group, we have a Discord group link um, in the uh, description. If you wanna check out that Discord group, it is a Shiba Inu Discord group that we created just to be able to talk about Shiba Inu in a big way and be able to focus on Shiba Inu in a big way. I can't bring it up right now. I was trying to bring it up, but I guess it won't come up. Um, but yeah, I we're creating it in order to talk about Shiba Inu and have these discussions like we're having right now, instead of us having discussions in the comments where there may be a, a scammer in every single comment, because I don't know why they, they continue to do that on YouTube, um, but they continue to do it. I guess they have some sort of success, um, but you can also uh, talk to me directly on uh, the Discord group if you want to reach out to me there or follow me on Twitter at Perry8K which there are also scammers and fake accounts. But anyways, let's talk about Shiba Inu. Let's talk about uh, she token or the potential she token and what, what I'm hearing about it. So first, if we look at Shiba Inu, the current price is up about 8%. It's at 0 0.00001200 1200 or almost 1300, basically like 12 and a half hundred. Um, you see that the market cap is at a $6.8 billion market cap, uh, fully diluted market cap, $7.3 billion. We are going to look at the amount of holders. Let's check that. So we are increasing the amount of holders, one point, almost 1.16. So we're getting back up to that or close to the 1.2 um, you know, million um, holders, which would be fantastic. Obviously, we want to see more and more holders as time goes on. And it uh, looks like we're in a little bit of an uptrend right now if we look at the chart. So Shiba Inu looking okay, right? At these lower prices, it's great to be able to get some more. I'm staking 350 million and I'm sitting on that 350 million for 90 days until I restake it after 90 days again, uh, because I'm gaining more and more as time goes on. I'm okay with that. Um, but what we're here to talk about is not about Shiba Inu's price movement. We understand that it's at a low price. Um, we understand that we're not seeing a crazy amount of volume, volume down 38%, as you can see on the screen. Um, what we need to talk about is the connection between she and Shiba Inu. From what I understand, you know, you have a stable coin to where you can back by reserve or back, or back by real currency. Um, and you can also have a stable coin that's an algorithmic stable coin. From what I've heard from sources, right, that it's going to be more of an algorithmic stable coin that's tied to Shiba Inu. And if you notice, Shiba Inu can mint can mint more coins because it doesn't have a fully max supply even though we believe the max supply is one quadrillion it doesn't have that fully max supply but it doesn't make sense for you to to pin a stable coin um to something like shiba inu so i don't know if they'll be able to do that and that may just be something that's coming through um you know the grapevine because of what's happening with terra luna i don't think they can find a way to change um that to have shiba inu tied to she maybe she is tying to shiba inu i really don't know but it wouldn't make sense. And I'll tell you the reason why. Um, when you think of a, a stable coin that is backed by, you know, another, or uh, yeah, a stable coin that's backed by another coin or a stable token at this point, uh, backed by another coin or another investment, the other investment usually has to be a higher price than what you would see in that stable coin. 
So the stable coin is probably gonna be what, like one cent or $1 if it's pinned to the dollar, it needs to be able to hold that value. With something like Terra Luna, Terra Luna was 80, 80 plus dollars, $100 that was backing the stable coin that was pinned to the dollar. <clears throat> so basically, if you get into trouble with UST, you can basically take 80, um, 80 uh, or 86 or 100 Terra Luna and find a way to fix the UST because you're taking $100 to, to fix a $1 stablecoin. You're adding so much into it, right? <clears throat> For Shiba Inu, you'll be pulling literally fractions of what that is. And it'll be 0.000012 uh, to basically make up a dollar, which means that you investing a dollar, you're gonna need to pull out over 100,000 or 200,000 or whatever, however much you're gonna need to pull out of Shiba Inu in order to even help out one of this she token, right? Or she stable coin. So it wouldn't be good for the the process really. So once that happens, I mean, Shiba Inu would decrease in price by minting new coins or um, adding new coins to, or selling new coins in order to buy she token to buy up the price. So that wouldn't be a good thing. Um, but then you can also uh, think about how it will affect the the holders of of Shiba Inu, right? So if they're finding a way to sell that in order to create a an algorithm, right, to go straight to the Shi token or Shi stablecoin, um, it it will not be good for the people that are holding Shiba Inu because it decreases the value of Shiba Inu. Now, I I don't think this is the best way to to do this, and I don't know if they're going to be able to do this. I really don't understand the detail behind the scenes. I just wanted to get the information that I'm hearing out there so that we can ask the questions. Again, when we ask these questions, they start to get answers, and we get clear answers saying, "Hey, this is not happening. The way that the stablecoin is backed is backed by this." They can actually give us those answers because right now, I don't know all the detail of that, and maybe I have some reading to do, but as I hear different things, I want to get those questions out there so that the people that are educated in the space can correct me and, or just answer the question. And then we can um, put like some sort of pin comment there and let people know this is the explanation that I got from the ecosystem devs that are creating the she token. They have no way to touch Shiba Inu because I mean, they don't own it. Nobody owns it, but they have a way to touch the she, um, uh, stable coin. So that's something that's definitely running through my head is, is this something that's going to be malicious to where you're going to basically attack Shiba Inu by creating this algorithm? Or is it something that uh, we're going to look at as, uh, you know, maybe a, a net positive? Or is it something that you're not aware of and how uh, uh, automated or uh, algorithmic stable coin or, um, you know, can can affect this, right? So um, when I look at it, I'm just still wondering exactly what this could be um, in the end. And again, the the unknown makes it interesting, but I also would like to know for the people that are following this investment and that want this investment to thrive, right? We have one po almost 1 1.2 million holders um, of Shiba Inu, and if Shiba Inu is going to be tied to something to where um, it's going to decrease the value of SHIB, I don't know if that's a good thing. So again, this is all um, speculation at this point because I don't have all the detail and the only people that do have the detail are the people creating it. So um, until I guess it comes out, we won't really know exactly how that's going to be pinned to it and what we can expect from that stable coin. Also, there's one other thing that we were looking at and from what I've heard, they're going to be using she a lot more in the metaverse and not just using shiba inu the stable coin would be that form of currency which is something that i i like right i'm not saying that using it in the metaverse is something that i like i'm saying using a stable coin <clears throat> as a form of currency within your different parts of let's say your ecosystem um it is great let's say if it's a business right a business you're buying a, a depreciating asset with an asset that stands still right it's not going to change value you're going to see it one a one-to-one -one with the us dollar and you can basically buy things with shiba inu or with she token um or she coin and uh um not lose out on any potential because you're spending a dollar for dollar and it's never going to change hopefully 
Um, but the way that we buy things with, um, you know, at Wellies or on now payments, we're spending Shiba Inu tokens where we would spend a million tokens that could eventually get to a dollar per token. And if they do, well, now we spend a million dollars on that burger, right? That's what I don't like is buying a depreciating asset with an appreciating asset. Um, but buying real estate or buying land and all that stuff is something that I would, uh, I would like with Shiba Inu, but if they're going to take away some of the use case of Shiba Inu and the metaverse and all that stuff and apply it to she token. I don't know how that's going to be good for us Shiba Inu holders if we're not building by utility or burning by utility or anything like that. So you let me know what you're thinking about this. I'm definitely having a lot of questions about certain things and I, I it's hard to get them all out or into separate videos so that we can ask those questions. Um, but this is what's on my mind today and hopefully you guys respect it and somebody can answer it. If it's, if it's not true, then we can totally uh, uh, look at this as um, a question and answer type of video and then people can uh, get that question that they may have thought of it's the videos out there and they also get that answer within a pinned comment so anyways guys hit that like button hit that subscribe button and i'll catch you in the next one